Okay, here's the tabletop. It has been completed except for the legs. The channel or the aluminum rails have been bolted here and here. And on this side, here and down there. Well, you can't see it really well. Yeah, there you go. So the tabletop is done except for the legs, which we're going to do next. Um, one thing I want to point out, and I'll try to put this in my notes in the book. When we were drilling this hole through, if it's not dead center, that's okay. But what we had to do, it's a there's a little wiggle room in here, but what we had to do was we had to drill this hole, kind of, you know, work it in there. Um, I don't know the best way to do it, but sort of groove it out a little bit larger. You could go with, a this was a one quarter inch bit, but you could drill this hole with slightly larger than a one quarter inch bit. Um, not too much, uh, not too big, but it gives you, you know, what it'll do is it'll give the screw enough room in there to line up with the, the um, cross dowel or the barrel nut that you insert in here. Um, drilling the aluminum rails was kind of tricky. If you're doing this as a one-man job, fortunately I have, like I said, two sets of uh, two sets of hands. Um, drilling this was kind of tricky, but it, it's not that bad if you just go slow. Drill it from inside here out. Uh, trying to put a bit on top and drilling through is going to be really tricky and impo almost impossible. So secure this in, it, however you can, even if it's maybe on your knees, but you want to drill. Um, from the inside out and this was done with a quarter inch bit and let me back up here there is the semi-finished tabletop